Worked for Carl Casper for, for over 40 years. Nobody can do anything better than Carl did. Carl's got movie cars. He's, he's got creations, I guess, is what a good example of what he's got. And he's still building them. It's the only place you can go in Kentucky this weekend and see $30, $40 million worth of cars. We've got cars from new cars to custom cars to restored cars, you name it, it's here. I think it's the shiny cars. People love shiny cars, old cars, that, like the one behind us. I mean, the contour of that car and everything else is just crazy, you know. Last year, we probably had 325 to 50 cars. This year, we got 350 to 400 in a waiting list. And that's the sad part. You can't get everybody in, but it's good. Kentucky's the only show that gets more applications than they, they can hold. They compete for points. And at the end of the year, which was last weekend up in Cincinnati, they had their grand finale. And then that's where the 12 to 16 top cars in the country are. And there's some here that w will be the big car that wins next year, the top car in the country. There is a connection between this show for the second year in a row and the WHAS Crusade for Children. Yes. So how can people get involved there and help the crusade? We're so happy to do that. I mean, it, Crusade is the best organization and charity that you can support. 100% of the Crusade money goes back to the kids. I mean, it's nothing better, and that's why we're with them. Yes, we have pinstripers coming in throughout the country, and they come in, do their artwork here, and it is sort of auctioned off, sold off, and all the proceeds go to the Crusade for Children, and last year it was over $17,000.